schief gehen. Oh, die Mutter. Ja, die Mutter vermisst Chloe natürlich. Aber was soll man machen? Wow, er versteckt Hi, sich Mr. Zeit. Amber. Chloe, what can I do for you? What do you think? I thought Rachel was perfectly cast. She certainly was. We're very proud of her. I had no idea they were going to do that. Do what? I don't know the name for it. Uh, reverse casting? Casting a, a woman as a man? Oh, I just meant the wizard part. Ah, uh, I suppose that's also true. So, you're a district attorney, huh? I'm your district attorney. So, I can call you if I'm ever district arrested? <laughs> What would you be arrested for? It was a joke. Not a good one, <laughs> clearly. Your daughter's pretty great. Thank you. We're fond of her as well. You ever feel like she's so awesome at everything that you just want to shake her? Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, me neither. Duty calls. <laughs> Hey, good chat, Mr. Amber. Mm-hmm. Wow. Sehr distanziert, der gute Mann. Yes, Chloe? Integrity, honesty, loyalty. What? It's on your lawn. Oh, right. Sorry. I guess I'm still getting used to being an elected official's wife. Uh, what's it like being married to the DA? Much like being married to anyone else, I imagine. But with a lot more secrets, right? Secrets? Like attorney-client privilege and all that. Well, as district attorney, he brings cases against criminals on behalf of the state. He doesn't defend them. Of course not. <laughs> so, uh, Rachel was pretty awesome tonight. Yes, she was. Though, to be fair, she's pretty awesome every night. I wish I were half as driven when I was her age. Me too. <laughs> I get the sense that you're a force of nature yourself. I can see why the two of you get along so well. You can? Because it still seems crazy to me. Plates? Check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? I will be a dear. Talking to James. As long as I can avoid using the words cheating and scumbag, I should be fine. Ach, das sollte klappen. Was willst du saufen, du Arsch? Something else? What's your vice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. Comical. Uh. Chloe, maybe you can help me understand something. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we're worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so unlike her. What do you suppose is going on? Besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another joke. You tell me. 
It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. And you were all too eager to play into our expectations. In my experience, that's a tactic people use to cover for someone else. Rachel is her own person. She's responsible for her actions. I'd be lying if I said I didn't have concerns about your friendship, but perhaps you're exactly who Rachel needs right now as she navigates the choppy waters of adolescence. Uh, thanks. <laughs> Toll. Was für ein Gespräch. Aber zeigt zumindest so ein talentierter Staatsanwalt ist, wenn er direkt gemerkt hat, dass Chloe gelungen hat, um Rachel da rauszuboxen. Yes, Chloe? The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. How am I supposed to get to China? Kidding. <laughs> It's the fancy looking cabinet, right? You got it. <laughs> Toll. Uh, it's the triangle shaped one. Basic shapes. <laughs> Now you're speaking my language. Was sitzt natürlich dort. <lacht> Auch nicht schlecht. Hofft Chloe jetzt, dass er Herpes kriegt oder was? Yes, Chloe? What else? <lacht> Feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. As our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the... It's cool. I've got my own. Oh. You never know when you'll need to light a candle. Right? You are a paragon of preparedness. Thanks. I think. <laughs> Time to light some candles and... Bless this joint up a bit. <laughs> Finally. Mrs. Amber has her back turned. <laughs> Time to fix this photo. Toll. Monster, Kraft Dracula. Ach, ich war schon mal ein Fan von Kraft Dracula, also. Good. <lacht> geil. Einfach nur geil. The Amber Family and Fire. What could possibly go wrong? Also, wenn ich so überlege, was Rachel so gemacht hat, kann eine Menge schief gehen. Wow. So, Chloe, are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? Not since this morning. Oh, gosh. I'm so sorry. No. Uh -huh. That's cool. <sighs> We're not. What about that fire? <laughs> <clears throat> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. The way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. Yeah. It's scary. After those floods upstate, I was overjoyed we had less rain this year. Who knew a spring drought could be even more dangerous? You never know where a deadly spark will come from. It's certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. <laughs> arson? Why would anyone do that? Any number of reasons. With everything going on in the world today, even a town like Arcadia Bay isn't immune to the ills of society. 
I cannot imagine how difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you. Aww. Cool. Thanks. Well said, dear. It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us. Family. Oh. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. As such, those we love must be cared for and never, ever taken for granted. Rachel Wheaton. Uh, yeah, that's super true. And also remember, Rachel, that even when shit's like the lamest ever, you can always run away from whatever's bothering you. As long as you just keep calm. An interesting philosophy, Chloe. Yes, indeed. Not one that I would endorse, however. I favor confronting my problems head on. But to each their own, I suppose. Oh, fucking blow me. Oh. Rachel? Ay, 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 ay. Hmm. Ablenken. Ah, crap. I I'm so clumsy. Uh, Rachel, can you come help me find another Stop fork? It. Chloe. I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel! Stop it, Dad. You're a hypocrite. Okay? I know. You lying, cheating piece of shit, <laughs> motherfucker. Excuse me? We saw you yesterday at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel? Honey, whatever you saw or think you saw, I know it's hard. But I need you to trust me. Think we saw? Are you trying to gaslight us? There's no thinking involved. We saw you locking lips with some other woman. Best part is, she and I use the same drug dealer. Oh, that's enough. You are not welcome here or around my daughter any longer. I know exactly what kind of person you are from the moment I saw you. And I let my wife's compassion get the better of you. Oh? What kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A broken girl from a broken home. That's enough, James. I will not have you continue to speak to her like that. Oh. Also, Rachel's mother is really right. Oh, 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 oh. Ich habe das Gefühl, gleich kommt wieder Feuer. Oh. Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Stop lying. Stop being a politician for one fucking minute. Can't you just be my dad? Rachel, that woman you saw. That wasn't my mistress. That was your. <gasps> du Scheiße. Ähm. Und wer ist dann die nette Dame, die Chloe in Schutz genommen hat? Das Dienstmädchen oder was? Shadows settle on the place that you left Our minds are troubled by the emptiness Destroy the middle, it's a waste of time From the perfect start to the finish line And if you're still breathing, you're the lucky ones Cause most of us are heaving through corrupted lungs Setting fire to our insides for fun Collecting names of 
The lovers that went wrong The lovers that went wrong Das war jetzt also Episode 2 oder wie? Jupp. Das war jetzt echt mal harter Tobak. Also die mysteriöse Serva ist also in Wahrheit Rachels Mutter. Also ich hoffe mal Episode 3 wird da wirklich ein paar Antworten bringen. Das soll ja auch schon die letzte Episode sein. Das ist ein sehr kurzes Spiel. Aber hey, wir werden es schaffen. Jetzt schauen wir doch mal. Schöner Welt. Du hast die Schuld für Rachel auf dich genommen, genauso wie 78%. Ja, gelehrt, du hast Damon das Geld geben, hat noch 35% gemacht. Du bist bei Mikey geblieben. Ja, das war auch eine sehr schwere Entscheidung. Du hast Rachel nach einem Kuss gefragt, genauso wie 72%, habe ich mir doch gedacht. Du fragst es Rachel, die ihr Armband zu geben. Mhm, mhm, Was gibt es noch so feine? zu gehen. Ein Stück geredet. Du hast dich entschieden, nicht zum Stück zu gehen. Du hast zugestimmt, mit David neu anzufangen. Du hast den singenden Mann auf das Armaturenblatt des Autos gestellt. Ach, das war optional, Ravi. Interessant. Du hast deine Schuld mit Frank nicht beglichen. Tja, was hätte man da auch großartig machen können? Du hast Steph nicht gesagt, dass Rachel Single ist. Du hast Steph gesagt, dass Rachel Single ist. Aha. Du hast Drew das Geld nicht zurückgegeben. Hm? Du hast Samantha keinen Rat gegeben. Ja, vor hätte ich denn wissen sollen, dass sowas Optionales noch dabei ist? Zu geben. Meiden. Du hast Samantha gesagt, nächsten zu helfen. Ja, ich glaube, das hätte ich wahrscheinlich gesagt, aber na gut. Du hast Victoria vor dem Stück ausgetrickst. <lacht> ja. Das hat sie auch verdient, diese falsche Schlange. Du hast Rachel gesagt, dass du nach Los Angeles gehen möchtest. Rachel hat James beim Abendessen angegriffen. Shit! 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 Okay, das war nicht unbedingt... Oh, ui, ui. Wie so ein Menü, danke. <lacht> Sonst würde es automatisch weitergehen. Tja. Wir sehen uns dann beim nächsten Mal bei Episode 3, die Hölle ist leer. Also bis zum nächsten Mal, tschüssi!